hello guys and welcome back to a new video so in today's video we're going to talk about a uh, super dry winter jacket so i'm going to give a little review on some fashion so yeah i bought a new winter jacket as you guys know it is super super cold in norway it right now minus 12 degrees celsius so i thought about giving you guys a little review i have never seen these type of videos before and i tried to look for it on youtube and it didn't really look like anybody had done this before so i would do this and also like i also order some clothes from like other brands as well so i want it to be like this as like a regular thing like showing you guys some fashion pieces that i'm currently loving also purchasing and like showing you guys some quality and like less quality clothes that i have and like overall i love fashion so i wanted to incorporate that more so i bought this super dry jack winter jacket so it is like suede material as you guys can see right here it's not like it's not leather and it's not what is it called like um I don't know it's like really thick material and it's kind of like rain resistant so it has like this uh, grip to it when you put on the jacket it has this black fur on it I really like it I think the black fur makes it a little bit looking like sophisticated but it's a fake fur just to throw it out there um, I don't care about like real fur or anything and I don't want to hurt the animals as well and then on the inside you see here in the in the hat they have like the sheep like a wool feeling is really soft and really warm as well you have that at the inside of the jacket as well so here you see the super dry logo i really like that i like that this is like super big and like such a statement and i have the size small as you guys can see here and uh, yeah on the inside this is also like super super warm and nice it's super soft so i love that and yeah this looks more like creamy than you guys see on the camera but yeah um with the lighting and everything it looks completely white it is completely new and on the half other part of the sides here you see um kind of like yeah the wool stops and like this goes over my butt so it's also really really long and so the jacket have like uh, four pockets one pocket at the front of the jacket right here this is like by the chest and also this part here at the like as a normal pocket like on the sides and i really like that i also really enjoy that it has the this material here so that you can like go into the waist so that waist goes like this and i will put it on right now so that you guys can see what it looks like on so this is what the jacket looks like on here i have it it is so super super cute in a moment i'm gonna talk a little bit about the price and everything but this is what the style looks like this is what i mean with like this this part here you can like zip it in more and like tighten it and then the waist goes more inwards right like this and then yeah i'm really short but you guys can see that it goes like above my butt over here so it's pretty long and then when you close it it looks like this this zipper i don't know it could have been a little bit better because i like that the zipper goes really quickly and fast up but i think it's because it is quite new so it's like not like used to like getting like zipped up and down so it's a little bit stuck at a time at the moment but yeah and also this is like how it looks on i think it looks really cute i wish a little bit that this would go a little bit more like like inwards because i think it looks a little bit cuter but yeah <laughs> This is it. It's super warm. And I also like that I don't feel really, really chubby in it. I feel really stylish. I really like it. And I also like the buttony, button details like here and here. It makes like and also that it's like silver so that it kind of pops up out more. So yeah, and then they have like the super dry logo right here. Really cute in like black and white. And it's just like on the arm only on one side of the arm you feel like that the arm is like getting sucked in so like when you close the arm right here it like covers all of the all of the hand and the wrist so that it doesn't like any wind comes in here which makes it a lot warmer and also that there were no wind that goes through it so um yeah now i wanted to talk a little bit about uh, how much it cost if it was worth it and everything I really love it. I love the jacket and that's why, well, obviously I bought it, but I also checked out other 
jackets that they had I thought that this was one of the best one they also had one with like um, with like um, fur that was like beige like here and I also thought that one was pretty cute but I chose for this one because I thought that it looked a little bit more blended in that you can't like really see it and like pop it out but also really like sophisticated I, I really like the black fur so I never had this type of uh, jacket before but I've had a lot of winter jackets because well in Norway it is super super cold so I would highly recommend to get like this type of winter jacket if you are looking for I don't know sometimes when I'm wearing winter jacket I can feel really like heavy and also that it looks really big and stuff so with this type of jacket it's not dune so it's not like goose um, feather like inside of it so that also makes it like slimmer and the material is like a lot slimmer than like the really thick like for example kind of the goose but it's also wouldn't say really really affordable but it was like a good price in my opinion so this jacket cost 125 euros yeah so I'm gonna talk about the price a little bit I think the price is of course high like but that's like most jackets at this time especially if you want to keep warm for like a long period of time and also want to have good quality 100 euros it's like the normal price i've seen i try to look for coats for my sisters i also try to look for like other types of winter jackets and it's easily like 600 700 euros it's like one type of jacket even like this type of jacket can be like super expensive so i looked at like for example canada goose power jumper those type of winter jackets super popular in norway you can also check those type of out but it's like easily like 600 700 800 euros or even like a thousand euros for a good winter jacket so yeah i yeah i think it's like super super expensive and yeah so 100 125 euros for this jacket i'm super happy with it it's soft like this material here it's so soft i really like that and yeah i'm really excited to wear it of course so i just wanted to show you guys a little review with my jacket i don't know if you guys enjoy this type of video so the or original price was uh initially 180 euros so i got a discount for it and there are a lot of shops right now that is having sale so if you guys are looking for a new jacket then you can check it out like different websites and stuff because they're selling tons and tons and tons of winter jacket because it's getting like more spring and stuff probably by the time this video is <laughs> it's up it's maybe already spring but yeah so right now in norway it's like january so it's minus 12 degrees during the evening like during the night so i really wanted to invest in like a good winter jacket and also make sure that i stay warm at least it's gonna be super super good here in the netherlands because i'm currently living in the netherlands and yeah so that was basically my winter jacket try on haul i talked about the price i talked about the brand this is super dry it is uh, not a really um cheap brand either so i'm super happy that i got it for like 125 euros because it could easily be like 250 euros for this type of jacket and yeah hollister also has like similar jackets like these and they were also like around 150 100 and maybe 200 euros type of jacket as well so there are a lot of like brands that has this type of jacket and yeah i really like it so that's my final conclusion i love it i'm really excited to wear it and it's really up my alley it's sort of like looks good and still keep warm so if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel that would mean the world to me and i'll see you in the next one bye guys